So can we talk about your body first? Because there must be a lot, a lot of pain going into it. Yes. Building you up like that. Yeah, it was a lot of blood, sweat, and tears for sure. Um, I think the diet was the hardest thing for me to, to kind of wrap my head around. I'm giving up, you know, the dairy, the sugars, you know, bread, all that good stuff. And I was stripping it down, being pretty basic. And then the consistency of just working out, boxing, lifting weights, you know, six times, uh, six, six times a week, and you know, sometimes two to three times a day. I remember Ken Reeves once told me that he was laying in a bathtub filled with ice to like kind <laughs> of like get the. Did you have to do anything like that? Was it? I, you know, I did. I really did not want to do it at all because I'm, I'm more of a tropical weather creature. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just that's just personally. Um, so Sly was the one actually that kind of really drilled it home. Was like, look, you gotta take this ice bath. Like. Just do it, trust me, you'll thank me in the morning. And then after a really crazy workout, you know. So you did do the ice baths? Yeah, 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 <laughs> the tub at the house, you know. The, the key is you have to get in the water first and then put the ice in. If you put the ice in first, you're not getting in the water. It's not happening. So that actually helps? Tenfold. Okay, so yeah. what about, uh, I mean, now you must be also very good at shadow, shadow boxing. Mm -hmm. Do you have any good shadow boxing tips that you can share? There's no real wrong way to shadow box, you know? I think you So anyone can do it? For sure. You get okay. in the mirror and you're literally, that's your opponent. As you, you're throwing one, just like Rocky said, you know, it's like you're throwing one, one's coming back at you. What you're going to do? You're going to duck, you're going to move, and it just, it just it quickens your reflexes. And um, it just gets you in the, 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 the muscle memory of throwing punches and blocking and catching. But when you were actually doing it in the movie, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, it's so easy to just actually hit someone. Oh, yeah. Isn't it? I mean, because mm -hmm. it looks so real, there must be like really difficult kind of thing to do because you have so much responsibility not hurting someone and, you know, I not getting hurt yourself. Yeah, I think, I mean, I don't think they were worried about me hurting them at all because those are all pro fighters. I think that wasn't the deal. <laughs> so you can and, just hurt them as much as you want. No, I, I mean, <laughs> they, I mean, they would literally say, try to hit me and then, I, you know, it just wouldn't happen. But when you dealing with the choreography, it's like, a, it's, a, it's a different thing. And they would feel horrible you know if they when when they hit me you know when they hit me or slipped up and they're always checking in to make sure i'm good you okay i'm so sorry and i'm like they're such nice guys it's crazy but um yeah when you're dealing with mental fatigue and you know and at, at a contact sport th there's going to be mistakes there's going to be slip ups and i definitely took a few real punches thank you so oh, much you this oh. no, I got it.